And so in all your experience, this was the only president that you felt like in every meeting you needed a document because at some point, using your words, he might put out a non-truthful representation of that meeting. Now, that's that's right, Senator. And I, I, as I said in my written testimony, as FBI director, I interacted with President Obama and I spoke only twice in three years uh, and didn't document it. When I was Deputy Attorney General, I had one one-on-one -on -one meeting with President Bush about a very important and difficult national security matter. I didn't write a memo documenting that conversation either. Sent a quick email to my staff to let them know there was something going on. But I didn't feel with President Bush the need to document it in that way. Be again, because of the combination of those factors just wasn't present with either President Bush or President Obama. Yeah, I, I think that is very significant. I think others will probably question that. Now, our, the chairman and I have requested those memos. It is our hope that the FBI will get this committee access to those memos so that, again, we can read that contemporaneous rendition so that we've got your side of the story.